Hello, hello. I am sitting here with my beautiful mother who means absolutely so much to me and I wanted to bring her on and ask her some questions so that she could impart some of her awesome wisdom that I've grown up with on you guys. So I'm going to have her talk a little bit about herself first and then I'm going to ask her some questions. It's going to be quick. Well, first and foremost, I'm the proud mother, Celeste, <laughs> and her older sister, Grace. Shout out to Grace. Shout out. And um, I'm happy to be here today to share some thoughts and words of wisdom about motherhood and about being part of your mother's future and past. <laughs> yeah, so I'd love to know what's been the best part about being a mother. <laughs> Actually, the, one of the best parts for me was pregnancy, believe it or not. I had wonderful pregnancies thankfully. And um, I gave birth to two very healthy young ladies. And for me, it's all been about watching them develop into themselves, discover who they are, what they're best at, and how they can contribute to society. And what I'm really pleased about is that both of my daughters have a real strong desire to help other people, to help other people grow and become the best that they can be. And as you know, Celeste is fully committed to that in everything that she does. I'm not paying her. <laughs> okay. And that was amazing. So the next question is going to be, what has been the most challenging part of being a mother? So the most challenging part of being a mother always <laughs> is uh, watching the disappointments and frustrations of your child. You know, everyone goes through them. Life can be difficult. Life is often challenging. Sometimes the things we've defined ourselves by change in life, and we have to grieve what we were and then move on to what we are and what we want to be for the future. And helping your child through that can be really challenging, but it's also very rewarding when we come out on the other side and that commitment's been made and you see the joy in what's going on on a forward thinking basis. Yes, I love it. So um, I want to ask one more question. Actually, maybe we'll go two more. But first, um, I want to ask you to impart some of your awesome wisdom on everybody. And maybe you could include a mantra that you go by or live by. <laughs> <laughs> a mantra that I go by yeah. or live by. Oh, my goodness. Sorry about that video splice. Um, I ran out of storage. So now she's going to pick up where she left off. So go for it. <laughs> so I guess I'm supposed to impart some wisdom here. So I guess I would say, in a mantra perhaps, I think it's always about be ready. Be ready for life as it comes to you. Be ready for any challenges that you might face. Be ready to accept and be graceful about the things that you're given and the gifts that you have. And as a mom, if I were speaking to another <laughs> mom or speaking to people who are thinking about becoming moms, I'd say, be ready to develop those critical thinking skills. Now, the girls would tell you that they used to get so tired of me in the car when I would say, well, what do you think? Put on your critical <laughs> thinking skills cap. But now, we each were one sick. of them. Again, yeah. we spliced stupid storage. Mom, please keep so, going. So as Celeste was saying, they were six when I did that. And here's the deal. At the end of the day, today, they both use those critical thinking skills every day. Celeste to develop her business in the incredible way that she has and continues to do. Thank you. And my oldest daughter as well in her endeavors as a coach. And I think that that early development is the most important thing. And if nothing else, as we think about who we are, just be true. Educate yourself, commit to yourself, and most importantly, find something to be grateful for every day. Yes. Uh, okay. So if you love my mom like I do, love this video. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But seriously, how amazing is she? So um, thank you, of course, for filming this video with me. It's so fun to watch her shine. And I love, love, love having her around. We've been through some really fun stuff together. And I just love her so much. So show her some love, too. And I really, I know she helped you just now. So let me know what you think. And again, if you want more motivation, inspiration, information like this, all about mental, emotional, and of course, physical health as well, go join my tribe. It's up there. I'm putting the link up there. Have an awesome day. I'm also tagging my mom. <laughs>